You know that summer has truly arrived when you have your first British cherries of the season. Waitrose is committed to stocking only British cherries this season during July, which is why I've come to Hereford to meet cherry grower Angus Davison and to see the harvest in action. So Angus, beautiful day, fantastic to be here. Could you um, tell us a little bit about the farm, please? We've been here 23 years. We employ about 70 people and the harvest is at its peak right now. Angus, what is it about British cherries that makes them so special? We don't pick them until they're absolutely ripe. The season's only about eight weeks long, so we have to make the most of it. The trees take five years to mature. This tree that we're standing under is about 15 years old. Would you like to try one? Oh, I'd love to, thank you. They're just so delicious, that kind of depth of flavour and there's that sweetness, no hint of acidity and just a, a wonderful, I'd say perfect fruit. Waitrose believes in supporting British producers and celebrating the best British produce. It's the Waitrose way. I guess you also have to contend with sort of fairly fickle weather, but uh, also I noticed quite a lot of birds around, so I guess, uh, I guess they're probably as keen on the cherries as we are. They love the cherries, and they tend to pick one hole in ten rather than all of one. But we cover the trees with tunnels and with bird nets to protect the birds going in, but the main function of the tunnels is to allow us to pick the cherries when they're absolutely ripe, because otherwise the rain can split them and you're encouraged to pick them too early. British cherries are one of those really special fruits which you have to make the most of while they're here. You use them in classic desserts like a clafouti or in savoury dishes as an accompaniment to duck. I think though that the best way to enjoy them is as they are, deliciously sweet fresh from the orchard. <laughs>